Hello, Hello Seahawks. Seahawks! How's everybody doing? Woo! We're good! Are we socially distancing? I know Mr. Rubio and I are socially go. distancing. Right? So you can see we are filming this distance, right? Because we want to remind you about that. But it is your friendly assistant principals, Miss Brantley. Mr. Rubio saying hello. And you guys did an awesome oh. thing during the first week, right? I would put our Seahawks up against any other middle schoolers as best return to hybrid students ever. There are no other middle schools. This is it. This is it. Serrano Intermediate. You guys right? rocked it. You guys did awesome. You're hey, doing such a good job. I just want to remind you guys, both uh, distance learners and students here at Serrano coming, uh, remember that Monday, everyone is a distance learner. We stay at home. Uh, we follow the schedule, right? And we get on our Zooms. We get in our Google Classrooms. And we do everything on our computer, right? And then the schedule looks like... Let's see. So our Tuesday, Wednesday, we got our A group here physically on campus. If you are a hybrid student who comes to campus for A, you are here. Tuesday, you have zero period, if you have that. Periods one, two, and three. And then Wednesday, you have periods four, five, and six. Everyone and that's for else? the A group? That's the A's. That's my name. What about the B group? B group. Can we make a B? I don't know how to make a B. That's a B. Why don't we put one with B behind us? <laughs> B. Anyways. Um, yeah, B group. So B group, you come on Thursday and Friday. All righty? So come Thursday, it would be period zero, one, two, three, and Friday, period four, five, six. And those are for our hybrid learners, right? Those students come to school. So remember, A group on Tuesday, Wednesday, B group Thursday, Friday. And everyone is distance learning on? Monday. Mondays, yes Mondays. it is indeed. Yeah. So, uh, But if you're not physically here on campus Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, or Friday, then you are still from a distance. So make sure you're checking all of those classes every day, right? You're seeing what your teacher's plans are and you're zooming in when they want you to be. Absolutely. And uh, hey, for those of you that do come on campus, right? You guys did amazing the, at the beginning of the school day. Everyone was lining up in the blacktop for the seventh graders and uh, eighth graders. You guys were lining up in the grass area. That was phenomenal. And we're gonna do a little more of that in the future. We'll tell you how. However, starting my, uh, Tuesday, we no longer have to do that. What can they do now, Ms. Bradley? Well, now that you all know where your classes are, if you arrive before the first bell rings at 825, right? Remember, so our campus opens up um, at 815, but if you, were, if you arrive before that, uh, before 825 when our first bell rings, you can hang out on the tables and on the blacktop, but you don't need to line up with your teachers. And when the bell rings at 825, you can use our one directional hallways, right? Enter through the entrance gate, um, and then you can go directly to class. So you no longer have to line up in your lines with your teachers and wait for your teacher to walk into class. So once again, just head out to the blacktop or the lunch tables and hang out with your friends, wait for the bell to ring, right? We no longer have to go to the grass area, eighth graders. Uh, as a matter of fact, it'll be closed before school. So make sure you guys go to the blacktop, utilize the entire blacktop and uh, the lunch tables. And I just want to say, before school, during school and everything, you guys have been doing an amazing job wearing your masks, uh, keeping that distance from each other. So we want you to, uh, we want to encourage you to do that before school and everything, right? So continue yeah. to keep that distance from each other. Uh, continue to wear your mask. I see a lot of smiley faces out there. Mm -hmm. A lot of cool masks. I saw Baby Yoda. Oh, Baby Yoda was one of my favorite masks, and Scooby Doo is my is my another one of my favorite. Yeah, masks. yeah, I saw Scooby. -Doo. Actually, you know what? I gotta correct myself. <laughs> it is the child, not Baby Yoda. Oh, sorry. Right? I would like to see a Mandalorian mask. Ooh, that yeah. would be awesome. Sport of Mandalorian. Yeah, yep, that would be really, really good. Um, what else can we talk about? Breaks. Yeah. Okay. So you guys have a ten minute break if you're here on campus. You guys have been doing an awesome job. You brought those water bottles. You brought a snack to fuel your brain, right, for the rest of the day. Um, so remember, break, you've got the lunch tables, you've got the whole basketball courts, so we've got trash cans out there for you to throw away your trash, which you've been doing a great job of. And you also have the forum as well. So any of those areas you can use to hang out during that 10 minutes. You may take off your mask if you're eating your snack. And then when you're done, you're gonna put that mask back on, which I've seen pretty much everybody doing that. Yeah, they've rocking. been doing great. So once yeah. again, if you're just sitting down, chilling, talking to your buddies, please keep it on. Uh, stay safe, be safe. 
Uh, but if you're eating, obviously take it off and uh, take care of business, eat, drink, uh, and then, uh, you know, when, when it's all said and done, it goes back on to make sure that we, uh, we are safe. That's right. Okay? Yeah. Um, hey, you know what? Serrano just is not here. It's also at a distance. That's right. Right? We oh. have our distance learners. My distance learner folks, right? Come on, guys. You, we are still, right, your biggest fans even from a distance. Okay? Yes, we so are. Even if you are not here. Oh, that's right. Right? Look at that. Even if not, you are not here, you are still Seahawks, guys. So have no fear. We are still here for you. So make sure you're checking into all of your classes. You're making connections with your teachers by turning that camera on. Camera equals? Connection. Make those connections, Bless guys. Your face. All right. Yep. Um, and if you need anything, we're here for you. So remember our guidance counselors, Miss Bean and Miss Blake, you can reach out to them anytime, right? And they can offer some support if you need anything. We are also here, right? So if you need us, you can always shoot us an email. You can call the office. We're here to help. Or we've got our text-a-tip number as well. So if you need anything, even if you've never stepped foot on this campus this year because you're a distance student, you are still a Seahawk and we are still here for you. So reach out, connect with us, right? Follow us on the social media, know what's going on. And if you need help, let us know. We want to hear from you. So please don't be a stranger. I know we see each other on the, on the Zoom links. You see Ms. Branley and I popping in and out of your classes uh, and whatnot. But like she said, please reach out to us. Uh, email, so follow us on social media. I know our guidance counselors have their own uh, Instagram that you can follow and see any cool things that they're doing. ASB, uh, you see all the crazy things that they've been doing, uh, and they'll, you'll be seeing some more stuff coming Heck pretty yeah. soon, right? And right now they've got um, their Tuesday activities are now switching to Mondays, guys, because we're all in a distance on Monday. So if you want to go to our Zoom ASB activities, check your planner for the Zoom code for that, but it's going to be on Mondays at lunchtime now, from now on. So this Come in Monday, right there, if you're seeing this today, right? Monday, check the planner, Zoom code is in there. So we're going to be doing those uh, Minute to Win a Cookie Challenge, right. potato chip, balancing the quarters on the elbow, whatever it is. Now it's on Mondays. Yep. All right? And uh, we're going to talk about some do's and don'ts here coming in the future, Heck right? Yeah. So if you are interested in how do we do things at Serrano, whether you're from a distance or whether you're here on campus, uh, Ms. Bradley, Mr. Rubio, we are going to hook you up on Thursday and Friday. We're going to meet with all of you, even if you're from, a, whether you're from a distance, learning from a distance. Or, or whether you're here campus. at Serrano. Yeah, we're going to meet with all of you. We're going to be Zooming. We're going to be sharing a, a Zoom link, and then we're going to talk about some do's and don'ts. We're going to go by and uh, talk about, you know, some directional talking again, uh, the way that, you know, the school flow of things. We're going to be sharing text and tape and talk about a few things, right, that, that we do here at Serrano. So... Uh, this Thursday, Friday, through your PE class, uh, we're going to be sharing a Zoom. Absolutely. So if you and we're going to give you guys an opportunity to ask us questions. A little Q and A. Yeah. If you're if you're confused about any of kind of our rules or the way we do things, we will be available for that during that time. So that is going to be during your PE class. If you're here on campus, then we're going to find a spot for you to socially distantly, of course, be in a room and hear from us. If you are learning online on Thursday, Friday, it means that you are a hybrid A or you're 100% online, the Zoom link is coming out through your PE teacher. It is also in your planner, all right? So check your planner where you are accessing this video from, and you can find the Zoom link. You might want to cut and paste it into whatever box you for period that you have PE on Thursday or Friday, okay? Stay organized, Seahawks. Check that planner. Write down your dates homework and everything it's the best way to figure out what's going on in this crazy world that we live in right now right that's right guys so i'm excited thank you we had a great week and uh, i'm looking forward to even better weeks so awesome thank you guys